Fantastic. All right. Don't want any books. Check the metal container. Empty. Oh, safe deposit box. That's right. I'll check that in a minute. I'm gonna check all these containers first. What have we here? Don't need any of that. Okay. All right. Safe deposit box. Oh, sorry, it's number seven. And search the box. Twenty Canadian dollars. Nice. Flare shell. I could use this. Isn't uh, Canadian money called loonies? Was that it? I guess there must be something on the something written on the cash or something. I don't know. More money. Nuts and stuff. Ooh, number 13. Maybe that's... Oh, okay, there's a couple different <clears throat> locked safety deposit boxes. I do have a crowbar. No, it won't let me pry it open. Okay. <clears throat> so, she said something about the farmhouse. <clears throat> so I think I'm going to have to go to some kind of farmhouse. Dude, I know. I, I wish there were guns in this game. Like, I'm sure there are, but I have looked everywhere and I haven't seen a single gun yet. I'm just like out here throwing rocks at rabbits and stabbing wolves like as they're attacking me. Okay, we're gonna drop off some stuff here. Talk to Grey Mother. Where's this farm? On the other side of town, the Barker farm. Okay. Might be on my map. Paradise Meadows farm. Grey Mother. Grey Mother. That was where the plane crashed. I don't see it written on the map anywhere. Should I... Grandmother, maybe this is it. Paradise Meadows Farm. She said something about Barker. I don't know. We'll go check it. I think that's where I was yesterday, though. Oh, well. Let's head upstairs, put some stuff in our stash. So we're, yeah, we're not wearing these anymore. Uh, which pair of socks are we wearing? Decent wool socks, worn wool socks. Okay, so this is decent wool socks. This is the stuff I'm wearing. So I'm guessing these are, I'm gonna change real quick, put those other socks on, because they look better. Decent wool socks, worn wool socks. There we go, much better. Uh, not wearing that, not wearing that, not wearing that. I thought we were wearing the dress shirt. I think we're wearing that too. But we're not going to carry around this heavy coat anymore if we don't need it. Because we got that parka. Okay, what else can we drop off? Got lots of food, which is good. So just store some of, the, some of this stuff. Um... Lots of candy bars. Okay. That'll help us with weight. Um, flare. Don't need the flare shells right now. I'll just put them all over there. Lantern oil. I thought I'd run out. I picked up some more. Oh, whetstone. When did I pick up the whetstone? Oh, dude. Uh, gotta sharpen my my tools here. Actually, 
options. Sharpen. Sweet. I guess I don't really need to right now, but I don't remember when I picked up the whetstone. Alright, so let's head to the farmhouse. How, how late is it getting? Oh, it's getting kind of late, but we can sleep at the farmhouse. I remember how to get there. Hopefully the wind has died down a bit. Okay, yeah. Yeah, it is definitely starting to get, to get dark, though. Back on the road again. Don't worry, we'll sleep when we get to the farmhouse, dude. It's just on the other side of this bridge. We can probably actually see it pretty soon. Oh yeah. See, there's the, the barn. I need to pick up more sticks too. I am low on sticks. Okay, so last time we were over here, there were a bunch of wolves over here. Hopefully they're all gone. Not seeing any wolves. All right, let's run to the house. Seems pretty quiet over here. I think we're in good shape. I think we've got plenty of wood for a fire tonight too. If not, we've got a good hatchet. We can break some furniture down if we need to. Check this real quick, see if we can find uh, a key in here, safety deposit key, feather, nice, dead guy, hey dead guy, can't break down this plank apparently, or this one, oh, can break down this one, get some firewood out of it. Is that a box over there? I don't think I looked in this box the other day. I don't know, just empty crates. Man, I really wish I had a gun right now. I could shoot your ass. Get a lot of good meat out of that. Oh well. What you gonna do? Into the house. This pack is getting kind of heavy. See if there's anything back around the house. Ooh, some more firewood. Awesome. Work gloves. Heavy leather gloves. Uh, I think the mittens we have are better. Something's making me feel really tired. Yeah, the lack of sleep. That'll make you tired, man. That'll take three hours to break that down. Forget that, man. That'll take an hour, and that'll take an hour. Alright. Okay, so we are tired and hungry. We should have plenty of wood to get a fire going for most of the night. Okay, that is helpful. Sun's about to go down, so before it does, let's try and find the key. And then we can sleep here. Nope. Key would be in a desk, you would think, you know. That's the only drawer in the desk. Nope. 
Yeah, I already searched all this stuff when I was here yesterday. Where else would it be? I mean, bedside table did me good last time. I'll check the bedside table again, I guess. Well, I guess I already searched it. Oh, that's right. Because I remember seeing the little thing, but I couldn't. It wouldn't let me search it. The little little circle came up. All right. Great. Uh, and now that we're here, we stacked a bunch of or uh, stocked a bunch of our stuff in here. Um. Lighter fluid. Yes, I'm taking that. What else can I put in here? Well, actually, once I burn a bunch of wood, that'll uh. That'll take a load off. Oh, we can use cash for tender. <laughs> nice. Uh, I don't want to use accelerant if I don't have to. So I'm curious, has anyone in here ever like actually started a fire by like rubbing sticks together? Like a Boy Scout camp or Girl Scout camp or something. Oh, damn it. That didn't work. Let's try, try this again. I've got a buddy who is in Boy Scouts who can like actually start a fire by just rubbing sticks together. I've never actually tried it. I mean, the science of it makes sense. I've just never just tried it. Did it once out of boredom? Yeah. Did I mean, did it actually work? You get a, a nice raging fire going? Yes. Got a good fire going. Need some pork and beans. It's actually pretty hard. Yeah, I could imagine it's pretty hard. I'm sure it like takes forever. Nope, just smoke a little, yeah. I know you have to have like you have to have good wood and good tender like some dry leaves or something. Dusty dog food, banged up dog food, banged up condensed milk. I mean, this is 750 calories. That's that's good, but it, it looks like it actually used some water too, which makes sense. Oh yeah, okay. So we were making it, and now we're actually eating it. Add some more fuel to the fire. So we want this fire to go all night. Um, let's get it going. Yeah, nine and a half hours. Good. Let's see how much that lightened up our load. Oh yeah, that lightened up our load a lot. Okay. Uh, let's just. All right, we'll eat the dog food too, and then we'll get some sleep. Fire going for nine and a half hours almost. Sun's just going down. Sleep for nine hours. Uh, okay, that'll be good. And sleep. See if we can leave, leave anything else in here. Um, don't know why we'd need the cash. Probably pretty useless, so I'm just gonna leave all the cash here. Um, not gonna leave any. 
need medical supplies. I think I'm wearing all of those clothes. Simple tools. Oh yeah. Uh, let's go to the workbench. I think that was a workbench in the barn. God, it's so dark. Man, I cannot see a damn thing. <laughs> okay, window. So the door. Okay, so the door should be over here. There we go. was a workbench. Yes. So we can make a snare. Cured gut. Oh, we don't have cured gut. I don't know how to cure guts. We need like a drying rack or something. Oh well. Okay, let's run back to the bank. Maybe I should have just like sat by the fire and passed time. We're doing alright. Temperature's dropping fast. We're all right. Okay. I think the bridge is over over here. Maybe. Or maybe I'm going the completely wrong way. You know, that's that's a very real possibility as well. It's, maybe I can use my my lantern. No fuel. Okay, whatever. Oh, I wanted the map. Can't feel my hands. Man. Okay. Now I'm definitely feeling like I should have waited. Waited out the storm. Oh man. Yeah, I'm starting to get hypothermia. Damn. Freezing. Should have paid closer attention to what I was doing. And if we walk enough in one direction, we're bound to find something, right? Here's a fence. Alright, I guess we'll drink some water. It's alright, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. We'll be alright. We got that new parka on, keeping us plenty warm. Do we. I think we might have walked towards the church on accident. Yeah, because this is the fallen log. So the church is down here. That's right. We'll just start a fire in the church, I guess. Or maybe this is the way to the town. Okay. What's our hypothermia risk at? 10%. We'll be fine. Oh yeah, no problem. We're close to Grave Mothers. It is Canada. Yep, it is the Great White North. A 
I love how the sad music comes in, like I'm gonna die. But I'm fine. See, we're at Grandmother's. See, look, there's even lights on upstairs, but once you get inside, it is pitch black. Other than the one fire she's got going in the middle of the house. Oof. Man, oh man. Alright. Uh, so let's eat some food. Sardines. Yum, yum, yum. Dog food. I mean, desperate times call for desperate measures. Chocolate bar. You know, gotta have dessert after your dog food. Alright, then we'll go pick up some more food up here. I did that backwards. <laughs> Alright. We'll go ahead and eat. Yeah, we'll go ahead and eat this since it's about to go bad. Yeah, I gotta get the, the bad dog food taste out of your mouth. Oh, I guess I gotta go to the bank first and actually get it. Get whatever's in the deposit box. I think this one was number 13, is what it said. What the little tag on the key said. Alright, run to the bank. Can't feel my feet. I know I've got fuel. I, how do I add it to the lantern? Drop. No. I want to add fuel. Maybe I gotta find the lantern. Where's the lantern? Lantern. Actions. Refuel. There we go. Much better. Alright, so now we can actually use the lamp again. Haha! It's nice to actually see what you're doing. Alright, number 13. No? Number 17? Maybe it's 15. There we go, it's 15. Gray Mother's safe deposit box. And more cash. Alright, Gray Mother. You've been holding out on us long enough. You better tell us what you know. My fingers feel numb. That's alright. You'll be able to heat back up at Gray Mother's. So we're not wasting fuel. Did you find it? Oh, I guess we're just gonna talk to her. Here's the safety deposit box from the bank. I still don't understand. Shh. Give me the box. <gasps> you sent me to steal jewelry for you? You said this would help me find her. Have faith, outsider. It will. This fish crazy. Do one last thing for me, and then I will tell you what you need to know. I'm finished with this. Yeah. I'll find my own way out of here. Then you will die like the others. Just one more task for Grey Mother. <laughs> the man who fell from the sky. And then you'll get the answers you need. <laughs> Thank you. 
feel like she said that last time. Oh, I can pl place it? Oh, nice. I don't want to do that. I just want to put it out. Put it away. There we go. Alright. Uh, so we're good on food and water. We're just gonna wait out a little bit. So we'll warm up and uh, hopefully the sun will come up. Look at that. Sun's coming up. Great. And we're plenty warm now. Wait, what do I need to do? She didn't tell me what I needed to do. She... She must put that bed there, or that chair there, because that wasn't there before. What's this last thing you need from me? Right or wrong from the past, outsider. That's all I ask. How can I do that? Take these pearls to Lily. Lily? Did see a graveyard. All this time I thought you were talking about my friend. I didn't. Who is Lily? You'll find her at the graveyard. The graveyard. Near the church. You would have passed it on the way into town. Why would she be waiting for me by the church? You aren't making any sense. There's a graveyard, dude. She's dead. You'll find her there. And your answers. Why did you get me to steal those pearls from the bank? Not from the bank, from the farmer, Barker. The farmer is gone. So he left with the other c cowards. No, he's dead. Looks like wolves got him. And so it ends. Okay. This better help me find my friend. Yeah, no joke.